Welcome to week number four for Pippa. My name is Jodie Bunting and this is our six week course where our slimmers are trying to lose a stone in the six weeks. Hi Pippa. Hi. <laughs> right, so you were fresh from Crete for two weeks and how's this week gone? Oh. <laughs> what happened this week? Um. Well, I haven't actually weighed myself so I feel like not knowing that there's hope that I might have magically lost some. <laughs> but I had um I went out for a meal Saturday, I went out for a meal on Sunday, and uh, I had a takeaway on Friday. <laughs> what takeaway did you have? Chinese. Okay. And where did you go to where did you go out to eat? On Saturday, um the crossing in Burton. Okay. And what did you have? Anything exciting? Nachos. <laughs> oh, I love nachos. <laughs> right, in your food diary, you have tracked one day last week, Tuesday. Oh, I know. I said I was going to do it tonight. I, I completely forgot. All I'm right, not... at least we've done one day. That's an achievement. <laughs> I um, I have had, I always start the day with one of those protein shakes. So the intention is there every morning to do really yes. well. Lunchtime, um, I've had a salad for today. Last week, I had a couple of days where I skipped lunch because I was too busy. And I know yeah. that's like a cardinal sin. And then for evening meal, I've just, just not stuck to it at all. <laughs> So this is the problem with missing the lunch, because the problem is you're so hungry by the time you get home, your body's literally just craving. Yeah. What about having a protein shake at work for lunch? Would that work or not? Yes. So I wait, wait now. I've stocked my drawer with about six of these. Oh, great. <laughs> so that if I am... Um... I don't have time to actually have a proper lunch. I can have one of those. That is perfect. So again, just by doing that, when you do get home in the evening, you won't be so ravenous and just <laughs> be wanting just sugar or anything. You you might be able to uh, actually eat <laughs> what you'd planned. Yeah. And um, um, I thought yesterday, I was like, right, enough's enough now. I need to start back on it this week. So I, I've made a proper salad. I had um, feta and beetroot today, but I've got chicken for the rest of the week. So I'm on. Perfect. Salads for lunch. And then... Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Ignore the uh, bunting flying around behind. <laughs> so you've got salads for lunch. Yeah. And when I finish work, I'm going to go do my food shopping for the week. But I'm going to use your 800 calorie keto um, mm. menu. Perfect. That sounds great to me. And as you know, keto has a really fast weight loss as well. So it will show good results. I hope so. I'm I'm really I'm very disappointed in myself this weekend. Don't worry. It was good fun at the time, but looking back now, I wish I'd stuck to it more. So this week. So what about this coming weekend? Is there anything to throw you off? Yes. Yeah. Saturday um is my cousin's wedding reception. So um potentially alcohol on Saturday. Okay. So if you can be good at all the other meals on all the other days and just have that as kind of your treat of the week, it's still possible for you to have a big weight loss this week. I'm hoping so because during like weekdays there isn't anything to stop me from eating really well and do more exercise. I did take the stairs, it nearly killed me. <laughs> <Did it? laughs> but it's good, floor. again, just doing little things like that is what really is going to count, doing it every day. Yeah. Just okay. get to the top of the stairs and feel like I'm having an asthma attack. <laughs> <laughs> so you said you're doing your food shop tonight? Yeah. Great, wonderful. So yes, follow that plan this week. Um, how many pounds would you like to lose by next week? Um, I think four pounds, probably realistic. Okay. I don't know. 
back yeah. to these loads, but <laughs> yeah, let's say four. I think that's a good target to go for. Mm. Fab. And I weigh right, myself any... when I get up in the yeah. morning. So You're you gonna weigh yourself in the morning. Yeah. Great. Okay. So I've got a starting point then of what I'm up to. Yeah, wherever it may be, we've got a start. <laughs> Right, any other questions? Um, no, I don't think so. Okay. I think right. I've got everything. I know what I've got to do. I've just got to do it rather than thinking a Chinese sounds nice. <laughs> what, let me just ask you this before you go. Why do you want to do it? Why? Initially, it was I wanted to lose weight so that I looked good at the wedding. That's happened. But now I've got a couple of summer dresses that I'd like to fit into and I tried them on and they're a little bit snug so <laughs> just like to lose a stone so that they they fit nicely okay so this is a perfect reason especially when you've already got these dresses as well you don't even need to buy them or anything they're just no. waiting there aren't they so every time that fits into your mind that you kind of want to take away or want to eat out you know, just try and keep in your mind that dress. Can you hang it up somewhere where you can see it every day? Yeah. Because yeah, again, I can that's put a it real, on yeah, I'm a real day. visual motivator then when you get up in the morning and uh, when you go to bed at night. Yeah. I could have it in the office. So every time I think of yeah. having quavers, <laughs> it's right there. Perfect. <laughs> so yeah do what you need to do just just remind you of your why because that would really help you this week i think okay and i need i need a bit of help to refocus i think <laughs> <laughs> right you right. can do it though i've got faith in you <laughs> thank you Bab. right any other questions no that's it thank you wonderful right well done pippa i will see you next week See you next week. I'll All text right. you an update. Thank you. Yeah, text me in the morning with an update of the weight. Okay. okay. Bye. Bye.